So what you just saw was a procedure called a radiofrequency ablation or RFA, which is a procedure that is used to essentially burn your nerves. Some very lucky people do really well with this procedure, but it doesn't always go so well. It's natural to think that if you just burn a nerve that's sending messages to your brain that it will take the pain away. But here's something you may not know that happens when you burn or cut a nerve. The nerve endings that were cut start to grow back as if they're trying to find the other end that was cut. But as it grows back, it essentially grows back in this spiderweb fashion that essentially expands the area that the nerve is able to detect information from. Also, all of those nerve endings that grow back are unmyelinated, which means that they're even more sensitive to stimuli than ever before. And remember that changes occur in the entire nervous system, not just the peripheral nerves. So burning a few peripheral nerves doesn't fix the changes that have occurred in the spinal cord and in the brain, just like amputating a limb won't cure the pain either. This nerve regrowth isn't just seen after RFA procedures, it's seen after surgeries as well, even those less invasive arthroscopic procedures. That unmyelinated spider webbing nerve regrowth can cause you to have more nerve sensitivity and more pain. This is something to think about before you jump into your next procedure. I'm Alyssa Wolf, a chronic pain specialist, and I'm here to help those who are fed up and frustrated with chronic pain retrain their nervous system. Learn more about my programs on my website and be sure to hit subscribe.